so we know that assistant electrical inspector exam is about to come so we all are preparing for that so as of now today if we consider we have 75 days okay here if you see the papers which are going to come in exam or general paper and specific paper and there will be a 1/4 of negative marking okay so for general paper we will be having they will be giving 300 marks and the duration for that is 1 hour 30 minutes and 300 marks for specific paper that is electrical and electronics engineering and the time assigned for that is 2 hours okay if we talk about the general paper topics i'll be taking in kannada language okay and uh, if you talk about the specific paper that is electrical engineering i'll take in english okay so dates are also announced for the exams we know that third and fourth okay third is the con compulsory kannada exam fourth june is a main exam that is general paper 1 and specific paper 2 morning we have general paper in afternoon we have specific paper okay so totally we have 3 hours 30 minutes so we have totally 75 days if we consider from march 16 okay and april 30 days and may 31 days so this time is very sufficient to get good marks i'm saying good marks okay in assistant electrical inspector so if we talk about the general paper 1 so here we are saying uh prachalita vidyamanagalu samanya vigyana karnataka itihasa bhagola shastra bharatada itihasa bharatada bhagola shastra samaja vigyana samanya baudhika samartika okay sambandhisida samanya gnanada vishayagalu dainandina grahike vishayagalu matu nigade pelisalada arhata parikshalli uttirana raguva vyakti inda nirikshisabodada prayogika gnanavannu olagondirutade okay so this is a syllabus for general paper as days goes on we will discuss each and every topics related to general paper if we talk about specific paper that is electrical and electronic engineering okay we have a subject called electrical circuits and measurements okay this is one subject and this is another subject they have merged as a one okay so we have seen uh, we are seeing here concepts of current voltage power power factor energy resistance specific resistance temperature coefficient of resistance likewise many concepts are there we will start with very basic okay like if you don't know about electrical engineering then also you will get to know what is electrical engineering by watching my videos okay so we have electromagnetics that is emft this uh, i want to mention one thing this electrical syllabus which they have given here is related with vtu okay they have covered the syllabus from vtu and if you talk about the electrical machines we know that dc machines and ac machines in dc machines we have a dc generator motor okay losses and efficiency related with them and testings of dc machines synchronous machines okay alternator and synchronous motor if you talk about transformer single phase transformer three phase transformer and basic concept of three phase induction motor starting and stopping speed control of induction motor single phase induction motors if we talk about analog and digital electronics and diode circuits we'll be studying some clippers and clampers power amplifiers transistor biasing oscillator bjt mosfet amplifiers and we will also studying lic's opms operational amplifiers frequency response combinational compensation signal processing dc voltage regulators okay likewise we have logic design and we will be studying some logic gates okay and gate or gate likewise principles combinational logic analysis design of combinational logic circuits okay sequential design analog to digital converter and digital to analog converter circuits okay and we have in now we have power electronics so in power electronics we will be covering power semiconductor devices okay we will be co covering power semiconductor devices acr mosfet igbt thyristor okay and there is a commutation computability power supply secondary uh, batteries basic battery charging concept electric traction okay 
many many concepts are there in power electronics also okay and uh, we have microprocess microprocessor and microcontroller 8 bit and 16 bit basically they are asking 8051 architecture okay so it is a 40 pin ic we all know that and we will be going through all the architecture cpu architecture what are all the input output ports what is stack how the data is transferred how the data is received through input and output ports uh, and here we have watchdog timer this watchdog timer uh, is we use in uh, automatic chocolate vending machines okay uh, in uh, digital cameras everywhere okay uh, so msp430 interfacing devices like led lcd external memory applications so now we have a signal send system uh, we'll be going with time domain representation linear time invariant system that is lti and fourier representation of periodic signal okay then we have discrete time fourier transform that is z transform and uh, digital signal processing dsp discrete fourier transform fast for fft okay algorithm design of digital filters ir filter fir filter and uh, this is one of the biggest ocean electrical power system we will be seeing generation transmission and distribution how electricity is generated with the help of generating stations we have n number of generating stations okay and uh, by generating that power how we are transferring the electrical energy from one place to another place or from one part to another part that comes under transmission and distribution we will be having some overhead lines and underground cables in order to transfer the generated power uh, we need to take care of the devices which are helping electrical energy to be transferred so in order to protect them we are having protective devices some switches fuser circuit breakers and elc bits earth leakage circuit breakers mcb miniature circuit breakers etc and we were also studying high voltage engineering okay what are all the principles of circuit breakers and everything so again we have here electrical design estimation and costing okay general principle estimation residential building electrification so for we, we will be discussing here regarding estimation and costing of uh, a building okay how how much will cost electrification of a building okay for light load how much for heat load okay there will be different electrification provided in building okay likewise we have here we can see that again we have power system analysis and stability control see we have switches we are transmission lines we have generation of power that is not enough that is not sufficient we need to control the stability that means here stability comes the delta angle okay that should be maintained less than 90 degree as we know that okay we will be discussing all those things symmetrical fault asymmetrical faults okay as positive sequence current zero sequence current and uh, here we have computer techniques that is ctps network topology network matrices okay uh, everything we have there and modeling system block diagram of signal flow graphs and time response here we have control system here we can see uh, they have mentioned control system as a sub topic control system is a subject but they have mentioned in a power system analysis and stability control concept so modeling of system block diagram reduction bdr and signal flow sfgs time response of the feedback control system stability analysis root locus stability analysis introduction state where state space variables modern mct modern control theory state variable analysis so if you go through some uh, vtu syllabus you will get all the subjects in the vtu syllabus from 1 to uh, the, sorry from third semester to eighth semester okay and we have electrical power utilization see we are okay what we have seen uh, till now so if you talk about electrical power generation transmission and distribution protection and uh, we have uh, power system control and next we will be having how to use the generated transmitted power in our home or domestic or industrial for that we will be studying heating and welding electrolyte process illumination likewise different uh, uh, utilization of electrical power we will be going through all the subjects and management and entrepreneurship 
okay these are all the subjects we have to concentrate okay so i'll be starting the basic electrical engineering in the videos i'll be uploading soon okay from tomorrow and uh, i'll be covering all the syllabus in a permitted time so all the best for your examination if i talk about the materials i'll suggest you to for current affairs or uh, science and tech you go for any compilation okay and gk and uh, for gk general knowledge i'll suggest nutan gk for kannada medium students and for english medium student i'll suggest lucent gk uh, if you talk about uh, electrical engineering i'll suggest vk math and jb gupta okay thank you for watching okay please share and subscribe to my channel i'll be uploading videos soon thank you